We're going to use this method to find the solid that we created by as a, a revolution solid around the y axis. So we have that the volume is approximately the sum of uh, the volumes of n shells, cylindrical shells, which is about or approximately given by the sum over i is 1 to n of 2 pi xi star times fxi star times delta x. And uh, we may calculate the volume precisely by the definite integral from 0 to, which are the natural bounds of the figure here. So the radius is taken from 0 to 2 and 2 pi x fx dx. So now we can just plug in this cubic function, so 2 pi x times 2x squared minus x to the power 3, and we are left with an easy integral, in fact. Yeah, so here we get as a primitive of this function, we get pi times x to the power 4 minus 2 over 5x to the power 5 within the boundaries 0 and 2. Yeah, so we obtain pi times, well, substitute 2, then we get 16 minus 2 over 5 times 32. And uh, if we plug in 0, substitute 0, we, we are left with nothing, so we get 16 over 5 pi. So this is a procedure that is called cylindrical integration. And this may help you to find uh, volumes of a revolution solids when you cannot solve explicitly for the upper and lower part of the graph.